Taurus, you have an interesting week. This could be a very significant week for you overall. I do feel everything you want, desire is there before you. This is a really good energy. So yeah, it's maneuvering whatever, challenges, good, bad, <laughs> you know. Um, so I definitely see a, a strong energy here. Um, this is a week definitely of managing. You got this. There's a yes here. Um, you have base energy for love. This is blessings coming in from the universe. For some of you, this is love. Maybe your partner buys you flowers or uh, surprises you somehow. Or um, this is new love coming through. A lot of help from your friends. There's a Pisces energy here as well. This is a highly creative week. I do see that music, this is good for musicians or listening to music, dancing, singing. It's coming into play. Um, you could be dealing with a cancer energy. You got watery energies here too. Cancer energy. I do also see an Aries energy. There will be some kind of a victory. It looks pretty good to me. It's um, no joke. It's victory. There is a lot of positivity here. You have luck. You have abundant energy. Everything you want is there before you. Okay? It's just some is divine timing and you also have to kind of put... Um, work into something, okay? Um, a lot more clarity is coming through. It's like a light bulb moment, okay? Um, though, what is holding you back is your own insecurities or your own self-esteem, okay? That's one thing I see. This is a new path, a relief, emotional uh, validation is coming through. Now, there are some important aspects here that I have to say. These are attachments that you have. They no longer serve a purpose, whether it's what you're attached to. Maybe you could be changing something about yourself or a situation. Um, and you're moving forward. And it's like you're telling these things that attach to you or people, you can't come with me. Okay? Because I'm moving forward. Other Or this energy is around you. Some people are moving on and they don't want to. They don't want to, they're moving forward in life, so you can't come with them either. So there is that energy of detachment, I have to say. You're drawing in a lot of energy, okay? Wish fulfillment, it comes with delays. This is drawing in a lot of energies. You've got a lot of options before you. Beautiful, sunny options and energies here. This is fun-loving energy, having fun. Oh, you're definitely in the spotlight. Uh, you draw people that are younger than you, children to you. Um, opportunities to you. I do see that this is great for like dating. Maybe you go out and people notice you and you're in, in the date. You're, I mean, you're just kind of in the spotlight, whether you like it or not. Um, I do see rebirth um, communications, but this is also don't believe everything you see or hear. This could be great with dating. Things do take time. Um, there is an up and down energy here. So if anyone has bipolar disorder or you're dealing with someone around you that has that, that's showing up. Okay. For others of you, this can be, be careful of depression. Yeah, you could be kind of overthinking some things. But anything that kind of comes negative in a, in a way, I have to say, it's going to get you to reassess things. It's going to be, we are going to be building again. I do see money, and this is making investments for the future. Um, this could be also um, an ending with some financial freedom for some of you, an independence, entrepreneur. Uh, you could be receiving some gifts. Um, maybe something that you invested or someone invested and then all of a sudden there's extra money maybe coming through. So I do see that energy. There's a shift and change with work, career and finances as well.